Our next question uh, is from uh, Amit. He says, are equity saving funds of any use given the LTCG? Yes, maybe because, uh, you know, think of it as a simple allocation of uh, uh, the equity income funds are 35% equity, 35% arbitrage and 35% fixed income. And it will be taxed at, you know, 10% for holding of over one year. If you are mounting a, if you are actually setting up a systematic withdrawal plan on a, uh, equi you know, equity saving fund, it will still make sense because for in case of a debt fund, uh, one is that, you know, this tenth, one third of the money in equity itself mm. with convenience and rebalancing mm. without any tax implication itself is advantageous. Uh, so, and on a, t on a uh, and because in the initial years, you are principally taking your capital back. Uh, because uh, most of the gain is still accruing and after one year uh, it will be you know taxed at 10 percent to, to the extent of the gains uh, there could still be a case for equity saving fund but choose the growth plan and mount a swp and have a limited withdrawal uh, and uh, i don't know over a period of time depending on the state of inflation maybe it loses its charm but uh, i think there will still be a marginal case for equity saving fund for its allocation for it for the pure merit of its you know allocation the way it is invested the way it is managed it's a conservative vehicle well, it's not a write off completely it's not a write off